welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel thank you so much for clicking if you're new here i am cherono and i'm a kenyan living and studying in the philippines but right now i am in africa and i'm coming to you live from my village in kenya and guys today we have a very interesting video i am being my mom today and i'm trying to i'm going to to prepare this so that i can uh, store some milk in it and uh guys another thing i'm also while on this i'm going to be showing you the process of activating charcoal so i'm going to use this to activate charcoal okay the charcoal that you see uh being sold in the supermarkets and stuff that you buy so i'm gonna activate it using this okay so i'll show you that process too and then i'll show you the whole process of uh preparing this doing this this is actually always my mom's work but today i'm taking a place and doing this okay so come let's do this <laughs> let's do so guys next i want to get these uh the things that i'm going to use to to activate the charcoal so this one is a special let me go outside and show you Goja, green. Oh. So let me show you outside. So guys, this is a special uh app that i'm using okay this is like it's a special tree kind of branch it's not any just any tree i cannot use this to activate the charcoal i cannot use use to prepare the calabash okay so this special one i don't know the name of it but you know you guys you know let me tell you something about uh about this how how charcoal is activated okay so guys this thing as a tree so this is what i'm going to use and this one actually is a special uh maybe it has a name but i know it as so short i know it has an english name so for those people who are here please help me tell us an english name yes i have it in my head but i forgot about it this is called so short and actually let's go in and do this let me not waste time i <laughs> Okay, so guys, first things first, I have to make sure that the fire is well lit because I don't want to spend a whole day here. So, yeah, so guys, I'm going to light this on fire, so I'm going to put it here. And wait for it to burn so i'm going to burn this and this one guys don't worry about the state of this thing <laughs> i'm using it to not to make my clothes dirty okay i don't wanna my clothes to be dirty and i don't want my dress to be burnt by the fire so that's why that's why and guys you see these things my mom is the one that is always decorating them she will burn something like um let me see if i can see it uh -huh. I thought I saw something like that here. Oh, here. You see this thing? So she will put it on fire and then she will use it to, as it, when it turns red, she will remove it and she will use it to, like that, like that, like that. She will use it to decorate this calabash. So that's, that's, that's what this is for. about this uh this has been done by our ancestors everybody like i realized some people left this they're they not they're no longer putting milk on this calabash 
we call it sauteed because uh, I don't know it's 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 a it's, it's a it's a big job doing this okay it's not easy activating the charcoal and stuff like that so that's why a lot of people have stopped using this because they want their job to be easy and stuff like that they want a hard job but you know this is the best this is the best if you should try milk from this sauteed you will love it believe me so guys you see it's already burning and then we do this so this is me activating charcoal as it is very strong actually so I'll put it back and then where did I put it you see this now this is what I used to activate the charcoal so I'll just do this so some people will be like ah. <coughs> the, oh. I'll get to show you the activated charcoal, okay? <coughs> I've not done this in a while. That's why the smoke is getting into my throat. of passage from mother to daughter okay so as you grow you learn how to do this your mom will teach you how to do this so my mom taught me how to do this because she's not always at home okay like right now she's not at home and that's why i'm doing this and you have to do it perfectly because if you don't do it perfectly the milk is not going to be so nice it might even spoil that's done now i want to go and pour out the charcoal so that you can see how activated it is you see this one is very dirty see it comes in and my cloth is very clean before i go see this water is boiling i like to drink hot water so. guys this is done and i want to show you just before i go that's the very charcoal how it is done let me show you the activated charcoal i'll even try it with this See? See? That they sell. Okay, this is not as fine as it, it is in the supermarkets, but this is activated charcoal. And it is very good for your health. Like when you're having stomach poisoning, you know. Even somebody that has drunk poison, they give them this. This is what they are given. The activated charcoal. So I don't know, it goes and absorbs the, the poison. I want to taste it a bit. Huh. 
them. So, sometimes when you have a stomach issues, like you are feeling, uh, ah, I know my mouth is going to be black because of this, but sometimes when you have, uh, you are feeling like your stomach is a bit bloated or something like that, you just put some of some what some some of this in, inside the water. You stir it, drink it. Let me tell you guys, it's going to be very effective. So anyway, so that's activated charcoal made locally here. So this is what we use. We don't actually throw these away. Sometimes when you don't have, sometimes we use this. We don't throw these away. So anyhow, let me go and put milk into this. I'll show you just a bit of it, and then we end the video. Okay? So come along with me. Let. So see, oops, So this is an old cream that needs to be washed and prepared so that we can we can get okay we can get the we can get oil from that okay so i'm going to do it later on or maybe tomorrow who knows but i'll do it enjoy the process Then I just step the cream like that. Put it here. So, guys, sometimes when we Okay. 
guys, let me <laughs> let me tell you something. When we were children, we used to lick this. We used to lick all of these and we used to take turns. Like me and my brothers, we used to take turns licking this. So almost all of my mom's children have, have licked this. So for real. So I don't know how it tastes now. Let me see if I can taste it. Mm. like um, the wild vegetables you put these so pause, pause. Uh, you must be wondering I, I left some milk here see come close I left some milk here okay so on this color batch, there is milk that is, uh, we call it maziwalala. I don't know what you call it in English, but we call it maziwalala. So, if you could come closer to see. You see? This is how it is. But you have to keep this milk fresh, because if you don't, it's going to be to spoil. So this is how you do it. We don't do, we don't do this every day, we do it every every week. Okay. You see there is water. So that means it doesn't have water. So if there's none, I'm going to fill it up with fresh milk. So I'm then close it. So this one is going to keep this milk fresh for another week so this is the famous mursik okay this is going to keep it fresh for another week and then the next week i also do the same thing okay so that is the procedure there's a lot of mursik here and i want to prepare it off camera okay because it's a thick and it's kind of like not a very clean game so i'll see you when i'm done doing that So guys, uh, that's it for this video, see, <laughs> as you can see my hands are very untidy, but uh, that's it for this video, please let me know down in the comment section what you think about it, and please also guys, remember to like the video, and uh, subscribe if you haven't already, and when you do, remember to turn on the post notification bell, so that you don't miss out on any of my new videos, so guys, until next time, bye, I'll see you guys.